Now, colder temperatures this weekend means you may be trying to keep your home warm, and it's important to do so safely. The National Fire Protection Association reports 80% of home heating fire deaths are caused by space heaters. ABC 17's Nia Hinson spent some time with a firefighter and has a closer look at how you can safely use one if you're looking to stay warm. Megan and Lucas, the Missouri Division of Fire Safety posted this picture today, warning people of what can happen if you use a space heater incorrectly in the cold. You can't even really make out what you're looking at right now. But I sat down with Gail Blumenkamp with Boone County Fire to learn the right steps to take so your home doesn't end up looking like this one. You can feel how hot that is. Feel it. Yeah, it is pretty hot. It, was it does get very hot yeah, very quickly, right? Negative temperatures are on the way for parts of mid-Missouri this weekend. Gail Blumenkamp tells me this means people will be making extra attempts at staying warm in their homes. This includes using things other than your heat, like electric blankets, space heaters, and gas fireplaces. About one third of home heating fires are caused by space heaters, according to the National Fire Protection Association. I got a closer look from Blumenkamp about the dangers of using one incorrectly. This is the limiting switch, so if you push it, like it's sitting on a solid surface, the light comes on. As soon as it falls over, that releases and the light goes off. So you can imagine something being right up against that, or this thing falling over against a pillow. Um, you, have a, you have the potential to start a fire. What should people know if they're trying to keep themselves warm? Most of them all have thermostats now, so they can't overheat. But accidents happen, right? And it could still happen. If we are at home, we're getting ready to go to bed, or we're maybe we're just going to go eat at the kitchen table, and this is in my bedroom where I was doing homework or whatever, shut it off. Best thing to do to be safe, just unplug it. The Blooming Camp also tells me in these extremely cold temperatures that we're seeing, things that you wouldn't normally expect to freeze will freeze, so he recommends that you keep both your cupboards under your kitchen and bathroom sinks open. We've had many structure fires where people have tried to thaw their own pipes out using a blowtorch. So if you do have a heat problem or a, a freeze problem, Call a professional, let them come out and thaw it out. Camp also tells me it's extremely important you're careful and pay attention when you're using wood burning fireplaces or stoves and to have them inspected. I thank you, Nia. Blomenkamp says he recommends you stay at home this weekend, but if you have to be outside, make sure you layer up and drink plenty of water.